Station 6, Jesus' Resurrection Jesus died and his body was buried in the tomb. Those who had followed him felt that everything was lost, for their hope and light had been extinguished. However, that was not the end of the story. Three days after being crucified, Jesus was resurrected and came back to life, just as he had promised. This proved that God's power was greater than even the power of darkness and death. It also showed to the whole world that Jesus truly was the Messiah, the Son of God. When women came to anoint Jesus' body with barrier oils, angels declared, Why do you look for the living among the dead? He isn't here, but he has been raised to life again. And after his resurrection, Jesus walked, talked, and ate with people for several days. He spent time with his disciples and reassured them that they had nothing to fear. Jesus also promised that God would send the Holy Spirit to be a guide and a counselor for those of us on earth. Before Jesus ascended into heaven, he gave us a final challenge. To tell others about him and to follow his teachings all the days of our lives so that his light could truly transform the world. Take your candle and light the flame representing Christ's light here in the world that could not be extinguished. We are also meant to be Christ's light in a dark world through our actions and words, making disciples of all nations. This flame also represents the Holy Spirit, which is often symbolized through fire. Let's pray. Risen Lord, your resurrection shows us that your love for us can overcome all sin, fear, and death. It gives us hope in this dark world, showing us that the worst thing is never the last thing and that we can have eternal life with you starting right now. We praise and thank you for this. Help us to live out this hope in a world and spread your light to all people. Thank you for sending the Holy Spirit to fill us as we love you and love others. In your gracious name we pray, amen.